complexities that Paula just mentioned because you are no doubt seeing a lot of information but also misinformation online about the coronavirus. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is putting some of those claims to the truth index to see just how true it really is and he joins us with uh, a curve that's been attracting a lot of attention. People talking about it on social media. What's it all about? Welcome in Devin. There are actually several variations of this going around but one is created by the University of Michigan that's been shared a number of times. Take a look. It shows two curves. Now the blue one shows a rapid increase in cases if measures are not taken in the community to reduce spread. The yellow demonstrates the slower growth of cases over time that occurs with measures to decrease transmission. Now this concept is not new and in fact this graph that's coming up is the original source of these curves and it is a very well known public health graph in public health circles. It's a tale of two cities basically Philadelphia and St. Louis during the 1918 influenza pandemic. Philadelphia had its first case on September 17th, but they decided not to react. And in fact, they allowed a public parade to take place 11 days later on September 28th. Well, that's where you can see on that graph cases shot up rapidly and they overwhelmed medical facilities. St. Louis, on the other hand, the dashed line, they identified their first case October 5th, but they quickly instituted social distancing two days later on October 7th. And as you can see, although cases did continue to occur, the influx was gradual, which gave doctors and hospitals time to properly care for patients and react. So on the trust index, this curve is in fact true based on very well established history. And you want to be St. Louis. Uh, maybe, exactly. maybe you have to deal with it for a longer period of time, but fewer numbers. It doesn't that. overwhelm the system, and that's really yeah. the point of yeah. all the measures that we're taking. We want to be St. Louis and not Philadelphia. Yeah. So yeah. important. Okay. Mm -hmm.